He seemed nice. Why? Because he had a pulse? <laughs> Who sent this one? It's on the house. Oh. Excuse me. Is anyone sitting there? Oh, not yet. Have you been here before? Yeah, I really like this place. What about you? Oh, it's my first time, but I like it too. I'm David. Jacqueline. Jacqueline. <laughs> well, Jacqueline, you can choose from one of the following questions. What do you do? Where are you from? Well, how about this weather, huh? Well, take all three. Um, I'm a legal secretary, and I'm from Chicago, and I love nights like this. What about you? I'm a composer from New Orleans. Mm. And the night is hot, but I like it like that. <laughs> Jackie. Mm-hmm. I have another question I'd like to ask you. Go for it. Could you introduce me to your friend? No problem. In fact, I'll give you his phone number. Nothing in here but bird food. <laughs> Sorry, Coach, I'm on a strictly regimented diet to speed up the healing process. How about a protein shake? Sure, I'll use it to wash down that bacon and cheese omelet. <laughs> Ooh, make that for two. How you doing, gorgeous? Good morning. Why were you in my refrigerator? I was in his refrigerator, and why are you in my face? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just... Didn't sleep well last night. Mm -hmm. Me neither. Some guy named David called me at three this morning. <laughs> Playing some song he wrote for me. He said you gave him my number. I was angry. Oh, that's okay. I gave my cousin Rodney's number. <laughs> what have you got to be angry about? It doesn't matter. No. Good point, Jackie. Let's go, coach. Oh. It's just that, you know, once I got used to the idea of going out, I was excited about it, and then I had such a terrible time. Maybe you just went out with the wrong man. I went out with the only man I know. You know me. <laughs> Gesundheit. How about next Saturday? I'm free. Uh, I'll be washing my hair. <laughs> well, how about the following Saturday? I'll be drying it. <laughs> you don't have that much hair. I'll grow some. <laughs> Don't do it, Coach. You telling me what to do? You don't know what you're getting into. I think I can handle it. You really don't understand. Hey, She's you very... want to give me some laps? No, sir. <laughs> All right, then. Wear something nice. Pick you up Saturday at 7. Excuse me, but you are not my coach, and I will not be wearing something nice. And I will not be ready one minute before 8. <laughs> I used to love the way he would snuggle up to me and nuzzle my ear. I loved Howard so much. Losing him was a real low point in my life. Yeah. Well, 20 years old for a schnauzer. <laughs> That's 140 for you and me. <laughs> but I'm sure if Howard were here today, he'd want you to have a big, fat, juicy steak. How about it? I just want something understood before you open that door. Yeah? Nothing is going to happen between us tonight. Okay. In that case, order the chicken. <laughs> I just don't want to get hurt. Hey, the service here is excellent. I don't think there's too much chance of that happening. Sam, I need to ask you a really serious question, and I need an honest answer. Okay. Did you ever cheat on your wife? What? Did you? Never. 
Do you swear? I swear. Now ask me if she ever cheated on me. Did she? It's none of your business. This is just delightful. Sam, I'm sorry. It's just... I haven't dated in 20 years, and I don't know much about you. Well, I don't know much about you either, except you're not much fun in the parking lot. <laughs> hey, you know, you're making this out to be a lot more than it really is. All I really wanted was some food, a glass of wine, maybe a kiss on the cheek. What I didn't want was an opera, so why don't we just call it a night? Sam. Are you hungry? Yeah. You want that steak? <laughs> Sam, I think I'll be eating chicken for a long time. I won't even bother to ask you about the lobster. <laughs> guys doing still up? It's one o'clock in the morning. Would it kill you to pick up a phone and call? <laughs> I'm sorry. I meant to. Well, did you have a good time? Uh, it was... What are you doing? <laughs> I'm checking for hickeys. Oh. <laughs> You're clean. Girl. <laughs> What's a hickey? <laughs> Nothing you'll ever have to worry about. <laughs> Listen, I appreciate the concern, but I am not ready for dating. And when I am, I'll let you two guys know. <laughs> oh, speaking of dates, uh, Kevin asked me to go to a party with him, but we won't be back until 12 o'clock. 10.30. 30. 11.30. 10.30. 30. 11. 10. Okay, okay. 10.30. <laughs> Don't mess with the master. I might not be ready for dating, but I got that mommy thing down cold. <laughs>